I'm going to talk about darkness turning into light. Darkness always gives way to light. It says in Ezekiel 4, verse 6, Not by might, nor by power, but by my spirit. The spirit of God is light itself. And it can light up a soul that feels as if it's in darkness. A person may be in such a state of mental or emotional depression that he or she may believe that God is far from them. They may believe that there's no help for them. It says in the Bible, Whether shall I go from thy spirit, or whether shall I flee from thy presence? To go from God's spirit, or flee from God's presence, does not mean to travel to some far away place, but rather to separate ourselves from God in thought and in feeling. And even when we feel separated in such a state of mind, God is there. And though we may deny God's presence, God is with us. And though we feel that we have lost God. God has not lost us. God is with us right where we are. Wherever our state of mind is, know that we just need to make a slight turn to realize God's presence and God's power and God's help. Darkness has no real power over us. It will pass, and darkness will give way to light. It will rise up to a happier state through God's Spirit and by God's power. Like the psalmist, we can absolutely know with conviction. If I say, surely darkness shall cover me, even the night shall be light about me. Well, may you feel this light of God today. May it be like a touch upon you. May it radiate from within you from center to circumference. And may it uplift you. May you know without a doubt that God's presence is with you, that God's presence is real, that God cares about you. May you have the light of God in you, and may it, once and for all, wipe away darkness.